once again, Cain boards the Amino. The Amino sets off on the journey to the Underworld. This really is King's Quest VI. Entrance to the Underworld. Okay, hello. No living humans allowed. Go back, go back. But I want to come in. Uh, okay, what do we have? All we have is a sword to show him, so let's do that. Hey, you are holding the sword of Kusanagi. Please enter. This is the least we can do for you. Alright, let's go inside. Where are you going? Back to Summit Temple already? Well, okay, I thought you said for me to go in, but I guess we can have a chat. Izanami is in Yamatsu. Cross at Misty Ferry. Alright. In we go. Misty Ferry. The ferryman is sound asleep. He won't wake. Alright, let's have a talk with him. Hello? Anybody here? No, nope. that's <laughs> some snoring if I've ever heard it. It's no use. He won't wake up. Okay, can I look? Where are we right now, actually? The ferryman is sound asleep. He won't wake. Can I look at your boat? There's nothing special here. Can I look at whatever? <laughs> it looks like a big squid octopus guy making a snot bubble. The ferryman is sound asleep and he won't wake. Alright, well this is pretty futile. Let's go over here. Do you have any advice for me here, friend? Is that ferryman asleep again? In that case, see the princess Toyo at the Chizu Sea. She is the goddess of nectar and can help you. Alright, let's try that. Off we go. Chizu Sea. Oh, hey. Come, come. Join us and have some nectar. Some nectar, spelled differently somehow from nectar, the literal sentence above, will refresh you. Kane drinks some nectar and feels refreshed. Okay, I don't think we actually took any nectar. Here, let me pour for you. There we go. Kane drinks nectar and feels refreshed. Kane regains his strength. That's what I was waiting for. Okay. Do you have anything else to say? No. Okay, what if I show you my sword? Cain draws his sword. A sword dance? Great. Come, come, dance. I guess they're having a party back there. And Cain, <laughs> Cain feels trapped and begins to dance. <laughs> Reluctantly. Why? Why is there no cutscene for this? This would honestly make my day if I could actually see this happening. <laughs> Alright. Ho ho ho! Great! Marvelous! The room rings with applause, even though we're clearly not inside anywhere. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. Alright, let's have a look here. We're gonna take a look pixel perfectly at this lady's bottle here. Take a bottle of nectar with you. It's really important and I'm just gonna mention here, when I played this the first time, I looked at the wrong part of her bottle and it didn't prompt me getting a bottle of nectar. And so I wandered around this part for a good half an hour wondering what the hell to do. So you have to make sure that you get on that perfect pixel <laughs> to be able to actually get that particular item. Alright, so we'll head back to the Misty Crossing now. And no matter what you do to try to wake this guy up, the only thing that will work here is your nectar. So we'll use that. Kane opened the bottle. <laughs> and surprise! He's so excited. Hmm, that smells good. The smell of nectar woke up the ferryman. I guess you can have it if you want, buddy. Kane holds out the nectar to the ferryman. Ah, very refreshing. The nectar woke me right up. 
<laughs> I wonder what's in that nectar. That's very nice. Okay, what else do you have to say? Yamatsu, huh? I'll take you right across. Okay. I guess let's go. Kane boards the ferry, which heads for Yamatsu. And isn't this place just the most beautiful? Okay, these guys suck. Every time you hit them, they burst into like a million little babies. So you really want to try to not hit them if you can like, handle not doing that. Except now our power is just so strong that it actually busts through all of these different enemies without much trouble. I just want to go in this tree. Holy jeez, you babies. Oh, hello. Suddenly a magic creature appears. A human. You must not venture here. A mere human dares to oppose me? A mono attack. I don't know that I really wanted to attack you, but... Man, why does this always happen to me? Can I talk to you? There's no time for that now. Okay. All I've got in my inventory is that damn sword. Ker-crash! Kane defeats a mono. Please, please spare me, giant among men. You'll really spare me? How can I repay you? Please be going on your way, sir. <laughs> okay. I just spared you and you said you owed me, but... Can I show you my sword again? Nothing happens. Alright, so I think he just keeps trying to kick us out. So let's head outside here. Again, trying not to fight those weird demon guys. If we can help it. And we'll kill the, uh, the Pennywise heads in the sky here. Gosh, they're so weird. Now there's a couple of places in this area that we can go. So the first spot that we're gonna go is up these steps. Oh, I kinda want that. Thank you. Take that clown head. Can we make it? Oh, nice. So there's a few places to go, so we'll stop in here first. Shrine of Izanami. Hey look, that's who we're looking for. Hello. What do you wish of me? Somebody said you might give me a gift. <laughs> the Lord of Evil is being revived. I come to seek help in preventing this event. Hmm, I see. I'm not able to destroy the Lord of Evil, but... If you are true of spirit and stout of heart. Okay, then what? What must I do? Find the mirror, then return here. Go to the shrine of Yamatsu in Tamagi. What do you mean? You must hurry. <laughs> okay then, can I show you my sword instead? Will you like my sword? No? Okay. Alright. I wonder if I can look at her. If she's got anything good for us. Nothing special. Oakley dokley. Back outside we go. Kaka! Thank goodness we don't die when we do that. Some more fun platforming in this game actually much better here than it was earlier on in the game. I will not complain about it, that's for sure. Oh no, I forgot about that guy's babies. Damn it, get out of here. Oh, I did get that ball, that's good. Man, okay. I thought I was going to be able to kill that eyeball. But not so much. I wonder if this is the shrine. Is this the one? Oh, hello, angry cat friend. The entrance to Yomatsu Shrine. Cerberus is here. <laughs> That's not a dog. And there's certainly not three heads. 
Oh, hello. Hey, anybody here? No, you don't want to talk to me? It is no use. There is no one here. <laughs> All right, well. Let's have a look. I have to get rid of this dog. Okay, let's look at the dog. Maybe that'll help. He's staring over here fiercely. Okay. Well, I don't know that using our sword's going to do much either. Kane shows the sword to dog, but nothing happens. Okay. Let's try going inside. Grrr. Alright, guess we're not getting in. <laughs> nice doggy. <laughs> no way to get in, unless we want to go in limbless or something. Okay. Outside we go, and we'll do our fun jump here off of these stairs as well, just for fun. Now, if we keep going to the right, we run into a dead end. So I'm just going to start heading back towards the left again. And hope that this clown head doesn't murder us. Yeah, definitely more welcoming platforming section here than that one that we ran into, oh gosh, so long ago it feels like now, where there was that, um, what was it now, that fire head? Do you know what I'm talking about? You guys might remember from earlier on in the playthrough. One of the very first action sequences that we went through, there was like a terrible head that kept killing us. And it used to shoot fire out of itself. It was just really bad. Yeah, this particular section, it's really just needing to hurry up and wait a lot. If you go too fast, you end up getting roasted. I think we actually need to cast Mars here. There we go. Oh, we have 80 strength now. That's pretty awesome. Okay. Kind of want that blue ball, but I also don't want to go back there. Okay. Head back and see our dear friend. Hello, friend. Tell me more. What's up? I went to see the god, Yamatsu. That guard dog is pretty foreboding, right? He likes music. Go to Toki Field and search for a harp. <laughs> okay, then. Off we go. Oh, man. I keep forgetting not to shoot that guy. Run! Oh my gosh, maybe we can just outrun them the whole time. Nice. Ah! Uh, there we go. <clears throat> Alright. Let's... I think... Can I look... I think I can look at this guy's ore and take it. No? I really can't. I know we need to get the ore, I wonder... If I can do that yet. Not so much. Okay. Well, let's go to Toki Plains. We're in Toki Field now. There's a huge rock there. Let's look at the rock. There's an object, object in a crack under the rock. Can I take the object? Take something? No good, I can't reach. Can I take the rock? It's too heavy to move. Alright. Let's go back to... Let's go back to the Chizu Sea. And we'll take some nectar from this nice lady again. She's our healer of the area, I guess. Like, we had Spaghetti Man. We had Midori and her grandfather. And now this nice lady to heal us up. So that's kind of nice. Okay. Back to see this guy. Can I take your ore? I know that we need it. Let me look at it. Maybe if I talk to him? Use this ore. It's old and I don't need it. Okay. Thank you. Don't worry, I have another. 
<laughs> Surprise! He just pulled that out of nowhere. This guy's all about fast moves. Okay, back to Toki Plains. Okay, there's a huge rock there. So let's use our ore. Cain sticks the ore in the crack and pushes. The rock rolls over. Nice. Guess we have to look at it first. This is the Mystic Harp. Okay, 